Sun and Uranus in conjunction is like what my hair is doing. Expect anything today, kids. Red robe astrology for May 9th. Indeed, today is the peak of the anything can happen and probably will energy that's part of this eclipse entire lunar cycle. That eclipse full moon had the Sun and Uranus near each other. Um, and when that happens, when Uranus is in the house, literally anything can happen and probably will. This is a planet of fast revolutionary change. The Sun is our conscious awareness we are becoming aware of everything that's changing and therefore things can happen fast today is certainly a day where anything can happen um, and it also can be a day where there's a sudden pivot or shift based on some stuff that's been building right so it doesn't mean you you'll be surprised by everything that happens today but you'll probably be surprised by at least a little of what's happening today look to the Taurus um, house in your natal chart because that's where all the sudden change is going to potentially take place. And understand, it's just a day of profound insights, um, uh, innovative approaches to things, and absolutely be thinking out of the box today. Um, now, the moon is in Capricorn, sort of thank God, because it's a grounded, earthy, uh, stable sign ruled by Saturn. So we've got a nice sort of strong center to hold on to with the moon in Capricorn. Um, and there's a sextile, in fact, from the moon to Saturn. So that's a stabilizing and helpful lunar aspect today. There's a trine from the moon to the retrograding Mercury, uh, who's not moving at all these couple of days uh, before he turns around. So communication is as stable as it can be today. But remember, you're, you know, Mercury's retrograde and suddenly Uranus can throw in some curve balls. In fact, there's a trine from the moon at, to, to Uranus that, that puts an extra little wild card into the day. It's like, be like the gymnast today, ready to do a backflip when the rug is pulled out from under you. Because really, anything can happen today. Have at it.